When you start thinking about AI and uh, development, how is AI reshaping the role of software engineers today? We know that there's lots of different approaches for doing code generation. We know there's you know GitHub Copilots and other types of uh, tools. Uh, with AI shifting from hands-on coding to more strategic and architecture-driven uh, approach, what do you see as the key elements of that transformation? Yeah, I, I think that you know my view is that it's become quite a binary environment. Right. So on the one hand, what I think, which is very publicly noticeable, developers are pushed towards become much more creative to mm. build experiment much more iterations, much faster build whether it's new brand new apps or software, or even brand new features. This vibe coding phenomenon has pushed developers to, to become much more creative. They become the ideas person. So they have every skill set and, and no excuse now to not become the pioneers of new ideas. On the other side, I think what is less talked about is also the, the vast quantities of backlog tasks, right? You know, any organization that has software more than a couple of years old with more than a million or two lines has a huge backlog of whether it's bugs that are non-critical features that, you know, are important to some customers, but probably not enough to divert the entire engineering team towards, or even just nice to have, like these ideas that are more rounded, but just require more engineering effort to do, but are sitting on a backlog. I think that is now the next frontier where people are focusing on to say, it's fun and it's useful to have greenfield projects and vibe to put your way through that. But what do we do now in terms of the backlog that we've had maybe years, if not decades of? 